K, rumors and news, you in the right place. Want a community that's cool, you in the right space. You want tips? Subscribe now and ring the bell. Then go to the park and give them hell. The Boot Squad is an organization with all winners. Soldiers up in formation, we all killers. And when you step on the court, yo, you're our dinner. When I play D in the fourth, yo, Kawhi Leonard. Wood up, wood up, it's your boy. You don't know brutal, sim on the scene, wicked and mean with a next video for y'all man so y'all know what it is by now I'll give you a five seconds five seconds to show your boy some love because you know youtube actually link the algorithms to likes the more likes the faster y'all get these notices on time y'all five seconds to like of the video y'all i know y'all got your boy i know y'all got your boy bruce squad we in the building logo squad we in the building now, I ain't gonna throw with y'all, man. The Puma Mania just ended and we went crazy. I went crazy. I grinded and your boy actually at Elite 2 right now. You know I always try to walk my way to Legend. I don't like to race, but I like to walk my way to Legend, man. And the progression is coming on very nice. They are very, very good pace. I can't complain. And one thing that Puma Mania kind of highlighted was a lot of issues, y'all. I ain't gonna front. The servers was so unstable, it's ridiculous. It seemed like a lot of people was on. And 2K actually squeezed a bunch of people into about four to five servers. You see, like, because I kept backing out and trying to load into better servers, and it just wasn't happening. I keep loading to the same set of servers over and over and over again, right? So there were a bunch of instabilities, people getting lagged out, people who are needing walking the water like Christ, corrupted files, um, error codes, people, it, it was just a plethora of people just you can't streak up because just people just ghosted. Sometimes you're not invisibility, people are being invisible. It, it's just ridiculous to, to the point that now we start seeing the signs. If I hear a team and say, bro, I'm not seeing no one, we like, bro, you're about to get an error code dashboard one time and let's let's reset the court like you start seeing the signs when the negativity is coming this is telling us that we are going through this a little bit too long and we understand that with a new console with the next generation these challenges especially considering that now we're in the middle of a pandemic and a lot of 2k devs are working from home some of these things are expected right but we can't accept that there's a lack of transparency. Um, transparency. <laughs> I said transparency. There is a lack of transparency. And no one is necessarily talking to us about these issues. It's like the 2K devs right now is in a hole. And I'm not talking about the ones who's on the front line who is not responsible for this gaming thing, like the Ronnie, like the Mitchell, like the like these people are not the devs. They don't necessarily go in there and change stuff in the game. I want Mike Wayne to come out and say, we know this is an issue, we are addressing this. Or 2K support, we want you all to start putting out, we know this is an issue, we are addressing this. We can expect a fix coming this time. And I'm um, involved in Xbox Insider and we get updates about issues like this a lot once you're involved in that program. Like... We see, like, even with the a lot of the crash and a lot of stuff, Xbox. If you're involved in the, um, and following their Twitter page, they tell you, look, we are addressing this. You could expect a patch this time and this time, so we are not left in the dark. And this is what's going on with most of the community right now. The next thing that really hard for me to ex accept is the fades is the fades and this is where i'm getting with this man hold on let's talk we're gonna talk for a little bit the fades have been an issue for every 2k after 2k 18. 2k 18 it might have been an issue but blow buys were so op that people probably look past them why do blow buys why do fades when you could blow by and get dunks why why what so but after that 19 20 21 current gen Fades off launch have been OP and have been patched 
every single year it's like routine right now the game drops with phase being op and then they patch it why are we still going through problems that we used to go through i'm talking about gameplay wise gameplay wise the servers might be unpredictable the stability within the game might be unpredictable especially since more people getting on the servers and more people start playing that might be unpredictable and this is from me not being a it head type person or a developer type person i understand that there might be an issue with that but certain broke mechanics certain broke things in the game like the fades that been addressed in previous 2k why are we returning why is this returning as an issue this should be on your board when creating the game because it's happened so many times so many years as do not drop this game where fades are broken supposed to be number one of these top priorities because every 2k i repeat every 2k after 2k 18 fades have been a problem of launch and why are we still going through this now the next thing i don't see anyone speaking about no one in the community is mentioning this is the rebound am i the only one that are experiencing no matter what position you're in the ball have a knack for finding the offensive players a lot of times we know a lot of guards not in this game with high rebounds this is a fact a lot of them have steals a lot of them don't even have like good defense to be quite honest a lot of the guards say to hell with defense and the ball keep leaving the high defended build i got when i got the right position and finds the offensive player this grind my gears i ain't going front with y'all <laughs> Like the worst thing, I lost so much games. We lost so much games to people that are taking fades. We finally get a stop or a good shot contest. And those go in, by the way, that's the next thing by itself. But besides that, we finally got them to miss. And guess where the ball goes? To the closest offensive player. No matter if we're in the right position to get a board. No matter if we got the best rebounding bills out there. It finds the offensive player. And guess what he does? Because we collapse to get the balls and secure that ball that we know we should have gotten because we got them, them to take that bad shot, which in most cases is a good shot in 2K. And they missed. Guess what? He finds the offensive player because everyone collapsed, got someone on the arc that's wide open to ice the game. And they probably most likely hit a white to end it off. It happens. I know this happened to you. I know I'm not the only person experiencing these downsides. Now, as I said before, stability, server stability, expected, right? All I want is some transparency. Even corrupted players and stuff, like I, I show most of these things are linked to the servers, but all we want is some transparency. But what I cannot accept is these legacy gameplay issues keep returning that has been a problem for years the fade should not be an issue till this day till this day the fade should not be an issue please address it and please for the next 2k don't make fades be an issue it seems like this is a trend i don't know if you all want people to create shot creating bills then patch them so they'll spend more vc y'all really don't have to do that right now people are spending vc no matter what to be quite honest you all know that's the 2k community but these things the rebounds in the phase definitely and they go hand in hand the reason why the phase is so effective is because rebounds on the offensive ends are so expect um it are so effective it is it's, ex it's really really effective because a lot of people we play against with fades unless that we really really bro they shoot like 50 percent 50 percent that means 50 percent of the rebounds are there so they're gonna hit like let's say five out of ten not five they're not gonna take five shots they said yeah yeah probably a five out of ten or so they will hit of course we're gonna double and they're gonna drop some some to the roller or whatever but yeah just so about five out of ten fifty percent ish and that's five boards out there and most of them goes to the offensive player 
Because sometimes, sometimes we do help extra, but a lot of times they do come from the weak side, box out, and guess what? It still finds the offensive player, which renders what we do obsolete. But anyways, man, let me know what y'all think about the video. As I said, there's a long list of issues that I've been addressed in my previous video. So I want my videos to be repetitive and they're saying the same thing over and over again. Fix the servers, fix the lag out, fix the thing, yes. Briefly mention it and let's go on to some of the gameplay issues, man. As like I said before, go in the comment section and put a list of challenges that you're facing that I probably missed out on, of course, in this video. Um, let's get this video out there. We gonna keep trying to get this game right. A lot of people they already say the game is trash. Give up on the game. All right, cool. I do enjoy the game mostly in wreck though. Mostly in wreck. You playing with five v five. It really hides a lot of these issues. To be quite honest, it really does. Which is why I was saying, yo, this game is one of the best because I was playing mostly wreck. But the more and more I play part, the more you're on an island, the more it exposes some of the um things that the exploits that people maximize and just to call themselves gods in this game and the more i, I kind of experience a lot of these issues the loading issues the glitching out issues the this that it's not that prevalent in the record at all man but anyways man it's all about getting this thing better if you're first time to the channel man don't forget man to like the video share the video and hit your boy your sub subscribe if it's not your first time, like the video, share the video, you never know who's gonna be informed, y'all. Your boy Simon, love, respect, bless up. Peace. Peace.